Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. By the title of today's video, you could probably guess what it's going to be about. And that's that I hit with the Travis Scott Air Force Ones at the Astroworld Festival. Now, I know what you're probably thinking. Victoria, did you get these at Astroworld Festival? And the answer is no. They did not have these at the Astroworld Festival. However, when we were there, we heard little rumors, little people tweeting around saying that the shoes were probably going to drop at 2 p.m. Um, if you were at the festival. So my brother and I were actually in the merch line <laughs> uh, trying to buy Travis Scott merch um, when the shoes dropped. And luckily I was able to get through to buy these shoes for my brother. Um, I didn't buy them for myself. I do not find these attractive, but I am bougie. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Like they're just not my style. Okay. But my brother loves Travis Scott. Um, he likes to collect his shoes. He doesn't resell them, so don't think that we're going to resell these. He's going to keep them to add to his collection. Um, but yeah, everyone was trying to get through in the line. Uh, no one had cell phone service, but luckily, I don't know. I think the shoe gods were on my side. And George, can you please get out of my video? Um, the shoe gods were on my side, and luckily I was able to get through. Um, I don't know who else hit because no one in the line really said anything. Um, no one in the line was really talking. But anyways, the merch video is going to come in another video. And I'm also doing an Astroworld uh, Festival vlog. But it's going to take forever to edit because it's my first vlog I've ever done and it's kind of all over the place. But anyways, alright, let's get into showing you these shoes. Alright, so here's what the box looks like. Now you'll see in the front here it says Cactus Jack and actually at the um, festival they had their own like Nike barn setup thing and then I took a picture with like this Cactus Jack thing. Hold on, give me a second. Let me see. And I was trying to do spooky vibes so I did this weird eye thing. There I am. You can't see it. But there I am with the little, um, go, let me try to raise up my, what do you call it? Yeah. There I am with the little Cactus Jack character. And at the top, hold on, let me see. You can kind of see that it has the same kind of like barbed wire effect. Anyways, not important. All right. So here is the front Cactus Jack. We got the little face logo on the back that okay and this one you I think the color is just so pretty look at that it's so nice open the box here I'm trying not to mess up the box my brother will kill me <laughs> slide these babies out I'm gonna put it down because I'm gonna break it okay and here on the paper I don't know if you can see it. It says Cactus Jack in Russian. Cactus Jack Records in Russian. Flip the paper. I don't want to tear it because George will kill me. Gentle. Gentle. And here they are. Okay. Here they are. In all of they're the same, but you know, small differences. We'll start with the left one. As you can see, we got a little bit of different patterns going here. We have the royal blue. It feels kind of like a like a suede-ish. We got this purple one right here, which you can tell is kind of like a burlap texture, but it looks like it started to say like the Cactus Jack records in um, Russian. And then we have it over here in kind of more of like a mustard yellow. And then right here we have a different type of yellow. And you can tell like from the box where I had Cactus Jack in the weird letters. Um, that's what that is. Right here on this little button. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see. Back here we have an MC which stands for Missouri City. 
Um, I think that's kind of where uh, Travis Scott grew up um, with his grandma. I saw it on um, his documentary, Like Mom, I Can Fly, on Netflix. Okay, anyways. Uh, so yeah, Missouri City, and this is actually a button. It's a working button. It's a little strap here. <gasps> there we go. Little button. Um, if you kind of move it, you can kind of see the next pattern. Um, which is like a like a more yellow and it's obviously his Cactus Jack logo, but I don't think you're gonna walk around like that. So what do you care? Um, but yeah, so that's the it's more of like a still the burlap texture um, With the yellow Cactus Jack and then here again, we have the Cactus Jack um, records in Russian and that's still like a burlap texture here we have the green and it's that weird lettering that was on the box and then right here we have more of like a like a navy corduroy you can see that yeah you can on this side the nike check is actually a uh, camouflage i don't know if you can see that it's a really hard um like canvas material right here in the front of the toe box we actually have like a suede material it's super George <laughs> uh, the suede material is real nice and soft and then on the toe box it's a really nice feeling um, leather looking on the top of the shoe like this you will see uh, the shroud separated in two different colors this is more of like a, it looks like a navy blue, but it looks more royal blue on camera, but it's more of a navy blue and then this is the corduroy darker navy blue got the zipper here zip it down um, Honestly, this is like <laughs> this is what I don't like about the shoe, but apparently it's removed. Yeah, it is removable You can remove it through um, the laces zip that baby back up But yeah, if you were to undo the laces um, You could definitely take this part off if you don't like that, but I think the laces are a really nice touch with the kind of a uh, burgundy maroon-ish uh, color but yeah definitely a lot of textures a lot of different patterns um, on this shoe uh, the what is this the right shoe actually has well this one has like a weird uh, like stickiness on it I think it's dirty but it has uh, the TX on this side while the other one had the MC because this is uh, Texas so Missouri City Texas um, is basically kind of where he grew up you know I mean he's from Houston but he basically grew up in Missouri City um, but again you can't uh, unbuckle this one like so very easy I didn't say Alexa okay but yeah little button um, it also does come with these kind of a I would say maybe like cream laces in the night bag cream laces uh if you want to switch it up and it also comes with these black ones isn't that nice well they look navy but they're black We've got the standard um gum sole and the stitching I don't know if you can see that much of detail but the stitching right here is actually kind of like a uh I wouldn't say lime green, more like a pastel green. I don't know if you can see that. Maybe, maybe not. But yeah, um, if you were to remove this um, shroud, the eyelids look like the suede and then kind of like a, what is that? Hard, no, it's not really like a hard canvas. It's like a suede and then it's like a frayed suede or something, but you can't see it. I'm not taking this off. My brother will kill me. And then on this side, it's like that green and then the gray down here again. I mean, like I said, it's just a really patterned shoe if that's what you're into. Um, it's definitely a very creative. They're out there. That's all I got to say. Um, but yeah, so we were lucky enough to uh, score on these when we were at the Astro World Festival, which is on Saturday. I think it was uh, November the 9th. Um, and we actually just got them today. Well, we shipped them to my brother's house, but um, he actually just got them today, which is the 13th. These will drop on the sneakers app on Saturday, which is the 16th. So if you are interested in these, definitely try to go cop that. 
Um, again, my brother's not going to resell them. He's not one of those people that doesn't appreciate the art of the artist. So, um, and he's a really big fan of Travis Scott. So I'm glad we were able to get these for him um, for retail. Um, but yeah, that's all I have. I do want to share a fun fact though. Um, we were at the uh, Nike Travis Scott barn thing. Um, I'll include some of that footage in my vlog that's coming up. But um, me and my brother were taking a picture with the big uh, Travis Scott shoe that they had. It was kind of like sculpture art basically and it was a huge life-size shoe. So I don't really like people to look at me but I wanted to take a picture with it so I tried to get in all quick. I was like take a picture of me right? And then apparently uh nice kicks had like a photographer nearby or something and they snapped this photo of me and posted it on uh their instagram look at that i look so content with my life i did not say alexa i look so content with my life in this giant shoe it was a lot of fun man i can't wait to upload my vlog but yeah, I just wanted to share that so y'all would think that I'm cool. Go like it. They didn't tag me in it though, so. But it's okay. Still had fun and we caught these shoes. The whole trip was worth just getting these shoes. But yeah, so I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm probably a crap reviewer of shoes, but it's okay. Okay, just don't be mean to me because I'm gonna get sad. But uh, try your luck on Saturday, you know? And um, don't be an a-hole and take, take this opportunity away from real fans that want to keep the shoe okay. Peace and love. Just kidding. <laughs> Do whatever you want. But anyway, so that's all for my video today. Stay tuned for my next one. I'm going to be uploading um, my Astroworld Festival vlog and my uh, Travis Scott merch, which is basically... A lot of my brother's stuff because I only got one shirt. But it'll be fun, okay? Yeah, that's all. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope y'all had a great day. And I'll see you in my next video. Stay golden.